It's been proven that music can bring many benefits, include, including simply joy to those struggling with dementia. Tonight, Veronica Cooper introduces us to Voices in Motion, a community choir helping to spread some of that joy. This is Voices in Motion, a choir for adults with memory loss and their caregivers, family and friends to share together. We found out about it through the Alzheimer's Society. Janet's husband Gary is struggling with dementia. My friend said, I want to go and that sounds like a good idea and, and uh, his cousin and his sister, everyone wanted to come. We're not great singers, we just enjoy singing and it's been a positive experience for us too. We're a close family. And uh, it's, uh, it's very precious to have that support. I don't get to spend much time with Gary, so this is good. This is the sixth Voices in Motion Choir in Greater Victoria. The first one started two years ago. There are over 200 people now singing in these choirs, in the six choirs. Um, three of them are community choirs and three of them are um, in long-term care facilities. And it's become like a, a, a family for us. She doesn't remember even driving here. She said, where are we going? Wendy and her mom drive from the Cowichan Valley every week to sing. She used to play music, she was a school teacher, she loved singing with the children. By the time we leave the parking lot, she doesn't know we've been here. But I notice that her mood is better for the next 24 hours after we've been here. We all know the impact that choir has on people, but it's fascinating and wonderful to have the research behind it that says, ah uh, yeah, this is actually making a huge impact physically in your brain, you know, in terms of the, the synapses and in terms of the, the, the neural connections and that are, that are happening. Well, I joined because Heather wanted me to and I love to sing, but if I'm adequate, then I'm fine to be here. <laughs> so we've been having a really, really good time and there are all kinds of other people here with um, their, you know, their mothers or fathers or as you saw, brothers and sisters. So are they looking for more members to join Voices in Motion? Absolutely, always. I would say we probably have to cap the choirs at 60 because then it starts to feel impersonal to people and can get a bit you know, confusing. But um, definitely looking for, for more people all the time. In my mind, I'm like, okay, how can we get this across the world in a way? You know, there's so many people that could be affected by having music in their lives. Yeah, yeah it's a very special time for us. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.